Troll sat alone on his seat of stone, and munched and mumbled the bare old bone. For many a year he had nodded near, for meat was hard to come by, done by, gum by. In a cave in the hills he dwelt alone, and meat was hard to come by. Up came Tom with his big boots on, said he to Troll, Pray, what is yon? For it looks like the shin of my uncle Tim, as should be a lion in graveyard, cave yard, pave yard. This many a year has Tim been gone, and I thought he were lying in graveyard. My lad, said Troll, this bone I stole. But what be bones to lie in a hole? Thine uncle was dead as a lump of lead, afore I found this shin bone, tim bone, thin bone. He can spare a share for a poor old troll, for he don't need his shin bone, said Tom. I don't see why the likes of thee, without axe and leave, should go making free, with the shank or the shin of my father's kin, so and the old bone over, rover, trover. Though dead he be, it belongs to e, so and the old bone over. For a couple of pins, says Troll, and grins, I'll eat thee too and gnaw thy shins. A bit of fresh meat will go down sweet, I'll try my teeth on thee now. He now, see now, I'm tired of gnawing all bones and skins, I've a mind to dine on thee now. But just as he thought his dinner was caught, he found his hands had hold of naught. Before he could mind, Tom slipped behind, and gave him the boot to larn him, warn him, darn him. A bump of the boot on the seat, Tom thought, would be the way to larn him. But harder than stone is the flesh and bone of a troll that sits in the hills alone. As well set your boot to the mountain's root, for the seed of a troll don't feel it. Peel it, heal it. Old troll laughed when he heard Tom groan, and he knew his toes could feel it. Tom's leg is game since home he came, and his bootless foot is lasting lame. But troll don't care, and he's still there with the bone he boned from its owner. Donor. Boner. Troll's old seat is still the same, and the bone he boned from its owner.